Hello and thank you for watching this video. Um, today I'm going to show you how easy it is to install Sosta Cloud Test Lite on your local machine. Um, I'm going to walk you through the whole process so that you can be up and running uh, in less than 15 minutes and start testing your web or mobile application. Um, the first thing you want to do is go on our website sosta.com slash cloud test slash light and you're going to end up on our cloud test light page obviously and you're going to click on that very handy download free edition um, because remember Cloud Test Lite is free and definitely you can use it to test your web or mobile application up to 100 uh, virtual user. You're going to fill up the registration form, um, the typical information, and you're going to click on submit. When you do that, you're going to receive on your uh, email account a very important email and I will advise you to read that email uh, entirely because it contains all very important information. I will go through those information with you today. The first thing you want to check are your the minimum hardware requirements. Um, so on your local machine, here I'm running Windows, but it could be Mac, you want, or Linux machine, you want at least 4 gig of RAM because the virtual machine requires 2 gig by itself. You want a 64-bit processor, and that's a very important piece. Uh, we're receiving a lot of questions from people wanting to install Cloud Test Lite on a 32-bit um, uh, computer, and it's just not possible. We don't support that. So you want 64-bit, and you want at least 20 gig of free disk space. The second thing you need is you want some sort of uh, virtual environment, namely VMware environment. So here I'm running Windows, so I've installed VMware Player, which is free from VMware, very nice of them. You can also install on Windows, I believe, VirtualBox, it works just fine. And on Mac, you can use VMware Fusion or Parallels. You can also install, uh, install Cloud Test Lite uh, on your VMware ESX, ESXi, or vSphere environment, no problem there. Third step, you download the package, Cloud Test Lite package. So for most of you, it's going to be the zip file because you're going to use either VMware Player or VirtualBox or if you're on Mac, Fusion or Parallel. And if you're running ESX, ESXi or vSphere, you're going to download the OVA file. But for us, it's going to be the zip file today. So you click on that link and it's going to start download, obviously, the zip file. And you're going to end up on... Um, with you know your zip file, you're gonna uncompress, unzip the zip file, and you're gonna have your nice little package here. Okay, now we're ready. Next thing you want to jump on VMware Player. I got it running right here, and well, very easy. You're gonna open a, a virtual machine, and you're gonna select it. So it's part of the package. So you double click on the package, and it's right there. Cloud Test Lite. Double click on that. Automatically, VMware Player, it, it's going to recognize all the settings for that uh, virtual machine. Uh, so the operating system, the RAM it needs, you don't need to edit any virtual machine settings um, unless you run into a um, network issue, and we can go through that uh, a bit later. Um, but all you got to do here is just play virtual machine, and it's going to boot up. Uh, cloud test light for you and in you know less than uh, five minutes you're gonna be ready up and uh, up and uh, up and running and you can start testing so here it's gonna boot up you're gonna see you know a bunch of just like any uh, this is a Linux environment so just like any Linux machine it's gonna start boot up the uh, operating system the kernel etc so you can see here it's Putting, you know, Cloud Test Lite by Sosa, it's showing you that uh, uh, it's progressing, it's starting all the, you know, networking, firewall, all everything that it needs, uh, that the virtual machine needs to run properly Cloud Test Lite. And here we're down uh, booting our um, instance. So Cloud Test Lite now is installed and how you access it, I remember this is a, a browser-based um, application. So it just tell you, you know, welcome to Sosta Cloud Test Lite, and open up your web browser to 192 and 
uh, 17. Uh, the IP obviously is going to be different for you, but um, but that's the IP it's been assigned to me. From that point, you can you know minimize your your um, your image. Um, you don't need it anymore. I mean everything is going to be through the uh, the browser. So let me go back here. And so 192.0.17 and click enter. Here, the first time you're going to log into Cloud Test Light, it's going to uh, ask you to enter your license key. And the license key, you can find it here on your registration email. I'm just going to copy paste that. Oops. And I'm going to enter it here and I'm going to click on enter. If you connect to the internet using a proxy, you are going to click here and enter your uh, proxy um, information. That's not my case. So I'm just going to click on enter and it's going to validate uh, the license key against our license server just to make sure that. Uh, you're authorized to use Cloud Test Lite, and here you have the Cloud Test Lite login. You're going to enter the username that you can find here. The username is always going to be Cloud Test Lite, and the password is Sosta. So Cloud Test Lite, and the password is Sosta. Uh, remember my username, and I'm going to log in. And when login is done, well, you're going to get that uh, uh, nice web browser interface. Um, the first time you log in, it might take a, a little longer because it needs to uh, uh, to set up some stuff. But once it is done, here you go. You get the uh, Cloud Test Lite uh, browser interface uh, available to you. Very nice, Ajax-based, where you're going to start, you know, testing. Uh, your web or mobile application. So, you know, very easy to install, register, download the image, install it under VMware Player or some, you know, uh, your uh, your uh, virtual environment that you, uh, that you want. And then you up and running in less than, what, 10 minutes. Um, if you need help, uh, installation help, if you run into issue, which is fairly unusual, I would say, um, you can go to our CloudLink community it's cloudlink.sosta.com and here you'll find many things. The first thing you find is support forum for Cloud Test Lite. So here you can ask questions, uh, you can uh, interact with other users. Um, I particularly recommend you to uh, read that Cloud Test Lite installation and configuration FAQ. If you run into any installation um, uh, prom everything is here so it covered you know the minimum requirement or I didn't get my email or I don't get an AP address every you know prom that you might encounter which is fairly unusual but you know obviously uh, we had people with some prom but we've you know uh, uh, archive all their question and answer so very important to read the FAQ uh, the second thing you might want so you have topic you can discussion board you can ask question about Prom, but also uh, how to use the product. You have the knowledge base, which is like the the whole you know documentation about the product. So you know how to create a performance test. Uh, uh, it explain everything about analytics and dashboard, the cloud test component. You know it explain everything you need to use cloud test. I will also recommend you to watch some training video. We have more than 50 here, very, very good video that you can use uh, to, uh, uh, to well understand better Cloud Test Lite. There are some introduction video, they have some uh, test creation, um, execution administration. We try to categorize all those video. Cloud Test Analytics and Monitoring 26 video, very, very nice video, uh, very, very useful. And you can also contact support if you really you can't uh, uh, figure it out with all this information, some of the, your prom or how to do things, you can contact support here. So I think you're, you're um, well, I think I'm done with my, uh, with my presentation here. Um, please download Cloud Test Lite today. 
install VMware Player and install uh, install it on your machine, and so you can be up and running and and start testing. Uh, uh, performance and load test your web or mobile application. Hope you enjoyed that video and next time I think I will talk about how to well how to record a scenario, install the conductor, I didn't go through that today and start recording some scenario. Okay talk to you soon, bye!